I'm gonna do a get ready with me to go do my nails. I have a nails appointment for the first time in a very, very long time. And you know what? I've decided to take care of me, to take care of myself. I deserve it because I deserve it. I feel like I deserve it. I always take care of everybody, but I forget about me. I don't feel that's fair. I'm gonna look decent and go do my nails. Yes. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it how this leaves my skin so glowy, but not greasy. That's the advanced night repair. I use it under makeup and it's amazing. It's amazing. Next, I'm gonna use a little bit of the e.l.f. Pori Primer all over my T-zone like that I did this in my previous email in my previous email <laughs> it might dream me out work in my previous video oh my goodness am I going crazy <laughs> in my previous email oh lord oh Jesus Now I'm going to use a little bit of this foundation, the Juvia's Place foundation, which I'm not a fan of, but you know what, um, I've been using it for my daily, you know, every day, whatever, not so much makeup, and I feel like it's okay. Just a tiny, it goes a long way, a little bit. And I feel like it does, looks better when applied with a brush than the sponge. It does looks a lot better. I feel like the sponge, for some reason, makes it like cakey. I don't know. I honestly think that it's a little better with the brush. Like, I just want a little bit, not so much, and it looks kind of okay. And now I'm going to use a little bit of what I have left of this concealer. But I'm going to use what I have left to go and buy a new one. Because if there's something I don't want to be storing... For so long is a lot of concealer and foundation. I don't want to have so much around. Uh, and then I'm going to diffuse this. And this is the widest shade I had for this concealer. But you know what? Now... It's the winter time is when I feel like I look my widest. And it's okay to use this one right now. I have to take advantage of 
what I have left. And I think it looks okay for now. It's about done. Anyways, let's use a little bit here. Whatever's left on the sponge. Mm -hmm. I think it looks good. <clears throat> let's move on to powder. You know what? I haven't used. Okay, wait a minute. Let's use this one. I'm also trying to finish these two that I have. So I'm going to use them both. I'm going to combine them. Um, I'm going to use the widest one on setting my under eyes. And then the banana color one on the face. Like that. I think that looks good. Perfect. A little goes a long way. Now let's use the other one on the rest of the face because I do like to set my whole face. And then I like to do a little bit of bronzer all over my face. But I do like to set it first with the powder. You see what happens to me? So I skipped a little bit because I feel like doing my powder and bronzer and eyebrows is not the most fun part of it. So I just skipped a little bit of that. Oh, if I could only find what I need when I need it. Oh God, my daughter is always taking my stuff. Okay, I found it. <laughs> the eyebrow brush that I like to go like this after I do my eyebrows. And they look a little bit better when I do this step. Okay, so now I feel like I'm ready for um, <clears throat> a little bit of eyeshadow, not so much, you know. Let me do a little bit of this like this because I already had a little bit there. Usually I have a primer, but I'm too lazy right now to look for it. So I'm just going to do this and use my concealer as a primer. There's nothing wrong with that. And try to make it today. Today I'm trying to do my makeup to feel better because I'm not emotionally very happy today. I'm not. It's one of those days. But you know what? We have to keep on going and we have to make ourselves feel better. I don't know. It's been tough for me this year. It's been a very difficult year for me. Um, and I'm trying to do better for myself and my kids. So hopefully 2024 welcomes us with a better better financial situation and better stability and all of that because honestly I truly truly need it I truly truly need it um let me see what I feel like using today let me see BH Cosmetics I don't know. Nope. Honestly, I don't even know what I want today. 90s vibe from BH Cosmetics. <laughs> it's BH Cosmetics today. 
No, this is too much color today. I just want something simple. And I always come to the same drawer. Ace Beauté? No. Mm. I think I'll do this one. Clover by Too Faced, one of my favorites from all times. Yeah, this is pretty neutral. I think this will be okay for us today. Plus, I don't want anything too crazy today. Let's just dig into a light color. This is going to this one today with a fluffy brush. And kind of apply all of this all over our upper crease, as I call it. Like a regular brownish color. It's called Fur Baby. And look how easily that applied. I love it. I love it when everything, everything blends, blends easy. And I don't have to like go crazy because today you know I'm not too creative but I also want to feel better better today okay that's looking okay it's looking better I'm gonna apply a little bit more because why not I like colors to really show and this is a beautiful chocolate color it looks darker on this on the eyes and on the pan next let me see what i can use next mm. why not why not i'm gonna use this kind of cherry color because why not because why not should I use the same brush? Nope. Let me use a clean brush. Because why not? I deserve a little color in my life. I deserve a little color in my life. Ooh, that's pretty. And why not, you know? Today I'm not in a hurry. I can do this feel better about myself and we need a little bit more oh this color is really pretty it's the first time I'm using this shade honestly I've had this palette for like five years and this shade is the first time that I'm using it and it's very pretty I like it it's very pretty look how pretty that looks that's beautiful. And I can bring it down here a little bit too. Yeah. But not with this brush because it's too fluffy. But that's very, very pretty. I'm gonna use a little bit extra here. And kind of mm, work it into the crease as well. I love this shade. You know? Doing my makeup makes me happy. And I noticed that I have to feel better in order to do better. Now, what else should I use? Mm. I think I'm gonna use that one in the front and then this on the middle. Because why not? Because why not? So, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use a flat brush like this and use this color here as a base 
and then I'm gonna use on the top that purplish color that I like so much mm, you see I didn't like it that much but now it's too late I have to go and I have to do this I have to do this this is fine I'm just gonna throw that purple on top and that's it I feel like this is okay right now <sighs> little bit of fallout mm. that's okay now mm, what am I gonna do? Yes, I know what I'm gonna do. Gonna use, you know, the same brush is good. Use a little bit of this as a primer, kinda. Oh, that looks pretty. Okay, so what I use as a primer, and it seems to work for me, it's um, a liquid highlighter that is not that much of a highlighter, but when you use it under something, ooh, it really stands out. Like, for example, I'm using it right now under this uh, beautiful purple right here. And you'll see the results. Oh my God. That is stunning. What a gorgeous purple. I use a lot of product again, like I usually do. And then I have full out. Mm. And today, I don't know why, but I'm going to use a little bit of my lower lash color. Because why not? And I feel like I'm done with this color. And then I'm going to go to my previous brush that I first used. Today, I'm a wreck. And the same brush. Kind of blend the top part. Again here for the lower, the harsh lines I think that's pr pretty I like it and now see this again okay we're done with that I'm gonna use a brown color on my where is it okay found it I'm gonna use this brown color on my lower lash. And let's see. Oh. I'm gonna uh, smooth it out with another, cause right now it looks a disaster with an eye, eye shadow color. And let's see how that looks later. I love doing this little extra step because honestly, it does make a difference. Um, let me see what I can use for this. Something like this, something like this. I'm trying to clean it. Um, the question is, what color, what color should I use? What color should I use? What color? Hmm. A brownish color? Yes. A brownish, but then... Something else on the bottom. I 
I smooshed it out a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then let me use another color like, um, yeah, why not? That corally coral color right there. Maybe just use a little bit in the bottom to diffuse it. Let's see. I don't even know what I'm doing today, but yeah. Looks better. Yeah. Why not? Looks better than it was, so. And let's do something on the. Uh, let's use something as a. Um, Where's a little here it is? As an inner corner a little bit here. Okay, I think that's it for today. I'm not gonna go all out more than this. That's okay for today. I did a lot of extras today. Let's just add some mascara and some highlighter oh i didn't use blush today i have to use a blush Ooh, i haven't finished that i feel like this is my little <laughs> therapy moment i'm going to therapy yeah doing my makeup because honestly first first and foremost my therapy, my first therapy is God. When I go and pray, that's my first therapy right there. When I don't feel great, when I need help emotionally, that's my first because God is my first. After I do that, then I want to feel a little bit better. Then I come in here and I do my makeup just to look a little bit more ready. And after that, I go, I get in my car. I listen to some worship music and that sets the tone. That makes me feel a lot better. Now I'm gonna do a little coat in the bottom because hello, we need that today. I usually do use a little bit. First coat, and then I'm gonna do a second layer, but first, right now, let's just do one. Uh, let's use a little bit of blush. And let's use the peachy blush today, because, oh my God, a brush on the floor. Because why not? I feel peachy today. Let's see. <laughs> Hi, Jane. Like that's enough. Mm. I'm a little pale today. This is a little bit of the pinky on top. Because why not? why not that looks better then let's use a little bit of highlighter because why not <laughs> that's my thing lately lately because why not
good. Now it's time for a second coat. I see that I really need to go and buy some mascara. I keep on saying that, but you know what? I haven't had the time with all this holidays and stuff. <clears throat> I haven't had the time. But I will. Maybe sometime this weekend. Next weekend. Because it is a weekend today. But... I'm good for now. I'm gonna do my hair and I'll grab some earrings and then I'll come back to do my lipsticks. Alrighty, so I'm back. I did my hair, something simple. And um, I also wanna go with uh, some simple earrings today. These cute little hearts from Betsy Johnson that I love. And they're very comfy. See how cute they are? Cute and simple. And for lipstick, I'm gonna do also very simple today. I feel like I should do a little bit of gloss first. Hmm. This gloss has a lot of color on it, but it's fine. I'm gonna tone it down with this nude color, but I'm also going to do a little bit of lip liner. I need to buy lip liner too, honestly. Look at this combo hop ready. Mm. Mm, pretty. It's still here. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Mm. Now, very pretty. Can use a little bit more of that lipstick. I love this lipstick from Juvia's Place, and the shade is called Muted. Mm, I don't know if you can really see it. Muted. It's this beautiful, like, nude. It's just beautiful. Mm, I'm done. I think I'm done. Oh, and I'm gonna use a little bit of my Mariah Carey Butterfly Cute Yellow Perfume. I don't know what's the name of it, but the original one was this one that I bought it when it first came out. And of course I've had many of these. Um, I forgot what was the name of this perfume. Anyways, I had pinks, I've had the purples, and now I have this yellow one that is very, very soft. And it's so, like every day, I love it. So fresh. And I'm done, my divas. I hope you like my get ready with me. 
I'm liking these get ready with me videos. They make me feel so much better. It's not like I'm giving a tutorial or anything like that. I'm just showing you like my everyday little routine to get ready. And I feel so much better when I do this. I see you, my divas, in the next video. Bye.